Yo, man, it's your boy Lakitu back at it with another fucking banger, man. You know how the fuck I'm coming, man. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about the video, man. Let's get to it. You heard me? As you can see, man, my portfolio is going stupid crazy right now, man. I was down here in the morning, look. I was down here and I'm up here. You know what I'm saying? That's how I'm coming. But yeah, for sure, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Soon I'm about to be going crazy, so man. I started doing my options game, man. My option game been strong as hell lately, you know what I'm saying? I'm on this AMZ shit. Cause they have earnings tomorrow and I feel like it's gonna run up. You know what I'm saying? I'm on this AMC. And I'm also on this um on this BA. And the reason I'm down on this BA is cause it ran up way too much already, you heard? From all the way in the bottom to the top, seven dollar run. That's a lot of profits right there, man. That's a 3.5 percentage. So I still bought a call because I feel like this shit could go to 236. You know what I'm saying? This is what I, this is what I feel though. And the reason, another reason is to that, is because Boeing, they they're about to sign the stimulus pack tomorrow. Don, that nigga on um, Biden said he was about to sign that bit, and Boeing should go off flying tomorrow. You can see he hasn't been in consolidation for a minute now. It's getting ready to take off tomorrow's. And hopefully tomorrow this shit open up at calm 240. You know what I'm saying? I think Boeing is going to open up at 240 tomorrow. If the stimulus is good and the markets receive it as a positive cat catalyst. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man. I'm also in this McDonald's. I made so much from McDonald's from 205. I'm going to run this shit up too. The reason that is because of the stimulus. Um, restaurants get like 10% increase in these, not a 10% increase in the stock, but 10% increase in McDonald's, which boosts the revenue of the stock. Simple as that. So tomorrow, I feel like McDonald's is going to be 212 on me if the market doesn't have a hard pullback because it's kind of rigged and shit, you know. And I'm on this can, um, can put there. I bought a $25 put. And the reason that is, is because this shit ran up $7 and this shit's going to drop back to what it used to be, to 17 And it has a gap, I think, right here. Let me see. Let me see if I can find it real quick. It has a gap right here somewhere there. I think if it breaks 17 it got down to $13.99 for sure. And that's going to be a lot of profit. All we have, all we need from this shit, it's a bad red day. So the bad red day is gonna be a Friday, man. Friday sell off on me, bro. Shit is predictable. And yeah, my IDX is printing though. As you can see, man, IDX doing lovely. I'ma hold it to March 19 and see what's popping over there. You know what I'm saying? Right now, man, I'm up $175, 46% from the 11 contracts. But I'm down on the other ones, on the 3.5 and the $4 contract. But I'm up big, though. You know what I'm saying? I'm up big. Once this shit go up to, like, $4, I'm going to be banking, like, almost 9900 or one k. I I would say. You know what I'm saying? So, the reason I'm saying that is because if you look at the, um, if you look at the Delta, that says 0 0.68. So, I'm making every dollar goes up. <clears throat> I make 0 0.68, 0 0.68. So 0 0.68 times one equals 68. So if I have um, how many contracts I have? I have 11 contracts. You know, 11 times 68. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all niggas do the math. That's all I gotta say, man. That's I know my calculations, man. They're gonna act this play. I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna show y'all in a couple weeks. Because it got one more week left. Watch. This shit going to go up. And I'm on the sense. I should sell this shit. Because it ran away too much. On cuz. But I should sell this shit. So you can see I'm up $8, man. But shit, man. I've been holding this stock. This um option for a week now. But I feel like this should. Tomorrow with the stimulus. This shit should push to 350 And then I'm going to take profits. Or maybe 4 And then I'm going to take profits. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no rushing me. But look, man, my baby caster is about to break that shit. You know what I'm saying? It's about to break the wall on me, dog. 
seen well never mind i can't even say that shit on youtube get reported or some shit yo man i had i made so much money from options man i just bought mass stocks i didn't even have to pay myself basically when i say pay myself it's when i get paid for my job to add it in robin hood and make a flip up you know flip that bitch so I bought this shit right here, this GTE, man. Back at it again with another one. You know, at 77 cents, man, oh, 200 in that bitch. Bought that shit when it was like right here on the lowest. Remember, always buy low. You get the best profits, man. So I'm barely bad. You heard me? And I bought this here right here. That shit doing good. This is doing me all right, $3, you know what I'm saying? When they really take off, when it goes back to that 1.50, yeah, it's game time. Sunday was doing all right. Finally got done fucking doing the one penny challenge. You know what I'm saying? The one penny. Look, 124, 124, 125, 124, 125, 124. You know what I'm saying? That shit can be tight. But look, PTN, man. Palantir Technology. I feel like this stock is amazing. I should have got, I should have loaded up on this stock. Should have got 1K on that hole. On me. Shit doing lovely. Staff. Staff is going to do amazing too. Shit going to go back to $1. And I bought 400 shares of this shit at the lowest I can, bro. The lowest I can. Like, right here. I wanted to get it right here at 62 But I couldn't. I couldn't, man. Hey, man. I'm up, I'm up $12, man. 4.69%, dog. Man, I'm cooling right now, man. Oh, me. You see that? That shit probably going to go back to the $1. Like 99 mark. Let me see where it went to. The highest ever was. 91. I'll probably go back to 91 or one dollar soon. I don't think it could break that one dollar though. So I, it, this is just a swing, by the way. I'm not keeping this one for too long. I'm gonna sell this shit when it hit like 90 cents. For a talk. Just an easy, a easy capitalization on your portfolio. Make your portfolio grow a little bit. Make 300 and take a cut. You know. And this is not like a CTRM. As you can see, the 52 week high is 124. So it's not going to do you no good, man. The CTRM, man, is really trying to break that bitch, dog. That nigga, that nigga really working for it, son. That nigga want to get it out the mud, bro. 13%. You know what I'm saying? Like, they really want to get it out the mud. And they keep fucking extending the, the day on this hole, bro. I hate that shit, man. Like, but yeah, man, it's your boy Lakey too back at it with another banger. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and keep me posted, man. About to hit that 5K soon, if God willing.